Hello, it is editing me here. I am putting together my video for the Woolly Steph ATC swap for my ATC swap with Andrea, the Cumbrian crafter, and I have lost the first video clip. Um, so it doesn't really make sense, this video. So I will just show you what I have got, and apologies. Um, I did make a bit of a dog's dinner of the first ATC, um, which you will see mm, about five minutes into this video. But thanks, Andrea, for swapping with me, and I hope you like what I did send in the end. So while that is set aside drying, let's have a little look and see what the lovely Andrea has made. So look at this. This looks like it could have been sprayed through a stencil um, with, you know, a spray like this. Um, and then we've got a die cut that looks like it's been inked and then maybe sprayed with some mica stain. Andrea the Cumbrian Crafter on the back. I love her stamp there. Isn't that lovely? Let's have a little look inside. I like the choice of colours, do you? Every adventure is worthwhile. Oh, look. Oh, I like this washi tape. Dear Ashley, please in find enclosed my ATC for Woolly Steph swap. <gasps> oh, you need a apostrophe there. Uh, I hope you are keeping well. Crafty hugs, Andrea. Sorry about picking you up on that. Um, it's one of my bugbears, these apostrophes. <laughs> this is lovely, isn't it? Modern astrologers differ on the source of the correlations between planetary positions and configurations. Mm, moon magic. Anyway, oh, look, I'm going to, I'm going to, oh, I don't know because I don't want to rip the card. That is adhered down very well. you come oh look i've ripped the washi tape i was trying so hard not to and now i'm showing addresses we don't want to do that do we oh dearie me i tell you i'm all over the place today right let's take it out and we will pop this behind so you can't see her details that she doesn't want sharing this is another lovely die cut so i think andrea always does this now she kind of links the card that she makes with the atc isn't that lovely that could be a jelly plate print this and this one says collect beautiful moments lovely flower there with some stickles on lovely so i'll be back in about an hour, maybe, with a dog's dinner of my ATC. We'll see if it's going to work or not. Thanks so much, Andrea. I'll leave Andrea's channel linked down below. And obviously, I'll also leave Woolly Steph linked down below. And if you want to take part in the ATC swap, it's once a month. Um, you can choose to swap internationally or not internationally. Um, it's entirely up to you. Um, but yes, I think Steph wants people who are going to commit to swapping. So anyway, I'll be back in a bit. So it is a little while later and um, it has cracked, but also it's coming away from the plastic. So I think this is not a good way to use this. But I thought just before I give up on it completely, I would reapply the stencil. I'm going to spray some of this in a piece of old cut and dry foam. And I'm going to pounce through the stencil and see what that looks like. See if it adds a bit more colour. But yeah, I can see I'm lifting up the crackle paste as I go. So that's not very good, is it really? So I think we're going to consign that to the failed experiment section. And um, because I want to get this in the post today, let me just find something to wipe that with. I'm going to go to a plan B. And I have looked on the back of Andrea's ATC that she sent me. I'll wipe that off properly later. Oh, no, come on, actually, do it properly. Let's get a, a fresh wet wipe out. You could do with cleaning your fingers as well. Because uh, I want to try and get this in the post today so that there is a a chance that Andrea will get it before the 1st of May, which is the deadline. Um, I'm going to kind of crack on with a little something. Right. 
yeah so she likes purple which i haven't got to hand <laughs> and bees and butterflies which i haven't got to hand but what i have got is some um background that i made recently um using a range of lindy's magicals spritzed with water and um some frontage so i think i'm going to cut this down to size and do something with this and i like this green bit here and the blue bit here for the sky now i've given myself a little bit of a problem here because i've already put frontage on this it's going to be difficult to stamp or stencil over that because it's going to act as a resist Right, so I want this to be just under two and a half. And I want this to be just under three and a half this way. So this is going to be the bottom of my image and this is going to be the top. We'll move you out of the way and we'll move you out of the way. Yes, yeah, so that's a shame. We'll perhaps come back to that idea another day. But you can see that actually the, um, what do you call it? Oh, get your words out, Ashley. Use your words. The mica stain did mix with the translucent crackle paste. Yes. So I think we will go with... Do I want some collage paper? Let's just have a little look at the collage paper and see if there's anything that we can use. Now, this is what I had on the original, wasn't it? And I think I'm going to stick with that. So let's get scissors. Just going to cut that little piece out roughly and then attack it with my water brush and then I can roll this back up and put it back in the tube oh come on problem is it's quite a sunny day sun keeps coming in and out but my hands are freezing so I've got a cup of tea on the go here right I will sort you out in a little bit Yes, I've got a piece, a piece. I've got a cup of puck of tea. My um, lemon and ginger, is it? I really like that. I'll just say it on here, actually, if you care to have a look. Lemon, ginger and manuka honey. Yes, I'm partial to that. But they're quite pricey, so I treat myself just very infrequently. Right. Um, I could do with some paper underneath to catch any mess okay water brush where are you hiding here you are so yes i'm going to do this again i think what i'm going to do because i've done lots of talking i will pause and i'll put you on fast forward So here I am with my finished object. Um, some things that I like about this. I like how the collage paper has, uh, the white of it has disappeared with the collage medium. And um, you can see the colour of the background underneath. I like that. I quite like my attempt at making the fairy sit on this line here, but I've missed a little bit of her bottom there. <laughs> um, I quite like the little bits of shimmer 
but if I were to do this again, I wouldn't stamp onto something that I've already frontaged. So lesson learnt, um, if you're going to add the frontage, which is lovely and blends nicely with the mica of the Lindy's Magicals. Can you see the shimmer on that? Um, do it afterwards because it makes it very difficult to stamp. Um, yes, it's the first time I've used this little stamp. I don't know if you remember, at the end of last year, Lavinia had a release and I bought the whole bundle. That's the first time I've used anything from it. <laughs> It's bad, isn't it? You see these things and you want them. And yeah, they've been in a uh, in a box where I keep all my Lavinia stamps. And yeah, they've been away. And I've just put a Tim Holtz clipping. Oh, a little bit of glitter on the wings, you saw me do. There's more glitter on there than um, I intended. But, you know, we all like a bit of glitter, don't, don't we? Andrea has got all my details. I'm just going to write hashtag... Woolly stuff, ATC swap. May 1st, 2023. I'm going to call it Beautiful Child. And it's one of one. Made by paper and twine for Andrea. I haven't decided what card I'm going to send her yet. If she puts this up on her channel, perhaps you will see need could do with a new white pen um and so there it is yes there's the one that we are sending here's the one that is the dog's dinner and um what we're done with andrea's here is andrea's there we go i'll be back very soon as i say i'll link woolly stuff and andrea in the description box i'm sure you all know exactly who they are but if you don't go and check them out take care everybody if you've liked this fail please give a thumbs up or a thumbs down any engagement is uh, welcome and i will be back very soon bye now